Hello and hi there and welcome to my first ever Star Stable video where I'm recording my own voice. So right off the bat I do apologise if I sound a little bit weird. I don't have a proper microphone for this. I am using some headphones that I think have a built-in microphone in them. So if I sound a little bit weird that's probably why. I'm also not very used to recording my own voice yet. Uh, and I'm not looking forward to editing this where I have to listen to my voice over and over again for like a hundred years. <laughs> but anyway, let's get started. So as we know, the new American paint horses will be coming out on September the 8th. And I don't even have one of the old ones. So I kind of wanted to buy one and have a play around with it and level it up just while we wait for the, um, for the new ones to come out and I've got like a million and three horses that I haven't trained yet uh, but oh well <laughs> we're just gonna like forget all them ignore them put them to the back of our minds buy a new horse and um, fill the void with that instead I think so let's just carry on up this road and uh, I think I'm pretty sure that all of the old like gen 1 and gen 2 paint horses are in um, the horse market outside Fort Pinter so we're gonna go and have a look at them well, I'm not gonna be able to jump over this but I'm gonna try oh I did usually you can't jump around horses for sale so it's kind of random that I was able to do that here we are now I've got literally no idea what rotation these horses are set at I'm pretty sure they're like one of the last ones um, but I'm just going to be super awkward about it. Probably skip through this bit until I see. I think they start coming in down there. Now, I don't want a Gen 1 uh, paint horse. So not these ones. Because as cute as they are, I just don't think it's worth me buying a Gen 1 horse. Especially not for 680. Like, I mean, they're cute, but like... That, that's quite steep for such an old model so we're going to put them on the back burner for now and I think I even know which which coat I want because I saw someone riding it not that long ago and it's very unique uh, I don't think there's another horse that looks like it in the game or if there is I've yet to find it I think it's the one that looks like um, it looks a little bit like the old Frisian sport horses yes this is the one now, I do really like this coat, but there's just something about this one. It just looks so weird. Like, every time I see it, it reminds me of a jigsaw puzzle or something. Uh, I kind of like how down here they look like zebra stripes, like inverted zebra stripes. It's got spots. Uh, it's got a cute face. And I like that it's black and white because then pretty much every tack you put on it will match. Uh, I will just have a quick look at what else is on offer. Um, I've got this like brown Appaloosa, a little bit boring. The, I do like these ones though actually. This one looks a bit like um, like a cookie dough ice cream, but I don't know. There's something about there's something about the face of these horses that's like a little bit janky. They look a little bit a little bit weird. But on the uh, on the darker coat colours, you can't really tell. Like if I show you this one, you'll see what I mean. They sort of look like a duck, in my opinion. I mean they're cute, but they sort of look a bit like a duck. So I think we're going to just go with the the original idea. I'm going to get this one. Uh, so it says, oh no, this is an Appaloosa. This isn't even <laughs> this isn't even a paint horse. Oh. Okay, well I guess that scuppers that plan then, doesn't it? Is this a paint horse? Okay, this one's a paint horse, so maybe I'll do this one. Because it's still fairly neutral. Um, so I think most tack colours will, will match this horse's coat. Well, there is this one, this black and white one. The one that I literally said looked like a duck. <laughs> um, I don't know, I'm just not... I just don't love how this one's face looks, like with the little pink muzzle. I mean... 
it's just not not really my cup of tea i also have like the um the gen 3 uh quarter horse that's like the black splash so i think i'm just gonna leave that one i mean this one's fairly cute this one hello <laughs> this one hello <laughs> what is going on with you this one's a contender uh, I then again, I don't see many people riding around on this horse, so... And he is a little bit uh, haunted. Yep, he keeps sort of jerking around there. Move randomly once more if you want to be bought. And if you stand still, I'll leave you and I'll go buy this one instead. It's up to you, my friend. If you make a weird movement, we're buying you. Okay, well he stood awkwardly still, so I guess he doesn't want to come and uh, live with me, so... Bye! <laughs> We're gonna get your friend instead. I can't believe that one's an Appaloosa, I mean... But I'm sure no one would, uh, would judge me if I got it and pretended it was a pain horse, but... We'll go for this one instead. Now, had I bought the one next to it, I think I'd have called that one Domino, but now I'm not really sure what we're gonna... What we're gonna name this horse. Trouble Drummer? Oh, I quite like Trouble. Uh, trouble pumpkin, trouble bag. <laughs> I'll go ahead and pick a name and then we'll come back. So I've gone ahead and picked a name and I think this guy's going to be called Quick Time because it sounds like it could be a real name. So let's go ahead and buy our first American paint horse. So Let's go and grab quick time. Uh, we'll put some tack on him and uh, yeah, see what he looks like. Take him around for a little bit. I haven't done any races today, so maybe I'll uh, I'll start training him today. But uh, yeah, I've never had, as I said, I've never had one of these paint horses before. I haven't had one of the um, the Gen One ones either. Uh, where is he? Let's go ahead and put some tack on him. There we go, got an outfit on him. It's quite hideous because I made it in about 10 seconds. It sort of gets the job done. Um, I really, really love how his little ears flap when he runs. Uh, when he's uh, trotting, should I say. He looks really cute. Um, so I love that already. Let's just give him a little, uh, little gallop. Oh wow, he's really going for it. Run. You forget how janky the Gen 2 animations are sometimes. Like, if I put this in slow motion and slow it down, you can really see how that uh, front shoulder is really, like, popping out and his head sort of uh, whips around all, all over the place but uh, oh a lovely jump love it but he's just really cute I mean there's there's something about the old generation horses that are uh, just really nostalgic it's like th this horse and I, I really love the uh, the gen 2 Morgan uh, I don't think there was... Oh yeah, there was a Morgan before, so I think it's the Gen 2 Morgan. That's also really cute. They just look so plastic. They look like a Barbie horse. But yeah, I, I, I love him. Quick time. So, hopefully I can get him trained up at some point. I might test out doing some races, and if I do, I'll insert the clips here. <laughs>
for watching me buy this horse and I hope to make some videos on the new paint horses when they come out as well. I'm so excited for them, the, uh, the pictures of them, the coats just look so beautiful. So I'm sure we're all looking forward to when they release. Anyway, thanks for watching for now. Bye.